Well, welcome to Tungsten Tales and thanks to Peter Wright for joining us. Peter, first man through to the third round. How does that feel? Yeah, I'm going to have a good Christmas. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking, looking forward to Christmas and having a time off. Is this the best you've ever played, do you think, Peter? Are you in the best form of your career? No, no, no. Not at all. I can play a lot, a lot, lot better than that, but I was happy the way I played, obviously, and with a win. Uh, but, yeah, there's more to come. Okay, well, you, you might need an extra gear in the next round against Phil, might not you, Peter? Uh, Phil or Mike, uh, whoever wins that match, is going to be uh, a tough match for either guys, you know, and it's going to be a tough, tough for me. So. I mean, you gave Phil a good match here three years ago, didn't you? You, you got it back to 2-1 and you had darts. I mean, you could have broken, got back to 2-all. I mean, are you a better player now? Uh, yeah, 100% better player than that. I've learned a lot doing the circuit, doing the tours. Uh, yeah, definitely. Okay. I mean, is, is it sort of like playing regularly every week? Is that what brings the best out of you? That brings your game on, does it? Yeah, it's playing all the, all the guys who, who are signed up all the, in, the, in the tour and everything. Uh, it's... They're all quality. They're all, in, even the ones who haven't qualified, they can hit nine darts. They can do twelves, elevens, bang, bang, bang. You know, some of the guys, you know, they might be here in a couple of years' time. Watch out, because they can all do it. I mean, is Taylor playing Taylor possibly? I mean, are these the kind of games that bring the best out of you? Are these the sort of challenges you like? Did you see Taylor in your draw, half of the draw and think, oh no, or did you think, great? My target was, yes, right. I want to play Taylor in the last sixteen. So I had to knuckle down and go, right, I've got to take care of my first first person I've got to play, then the next round, you know, but I took it one leg at a time, not, oh, I want to be there, I want to be, you know, last 16, and if I, it was like one leg at a time, one set at a time, and just work your way through it. So. And what's the thinking behind changing your darts all the time then, uh, Peter? What, what is, it? is that, um, is that what's, what's the thinking behind that? Well, I'm trying to, I want to win titles and everything and with my other darts yeah they i can win floor tournaments and play well on the floor with them but they don't fly right on tv they just fly completely different i don't know if it's the atmosphere the heat or the the lights or whatever it's just something wrong and that's why i had to find a dart that actually flies up but then i've found one now so a bit more practice with them i'll be a very happy man <laughs> i mean you're going to be practicing on christmas day then peter what's christmas going to be like uh, spending Christmas with family and going to have a great time and then yeah I'll have a little practice on Christmas Day obviously I've got to and then travel down Boxing Day get ready for the 27th okay. All right. thank you for your time Peter